Alrighty guys, I know I've been away from YouTube for a while, haven't been making many videos, but I'm coming back with a big bang, um, because I recently went up to Perth and I got 10 ceiling fans. I actually got 11, but I don't have one of them because it was just a cheapy Bunnings Zarlek, so I gave it to my friend. Um, but, um, yes, I have a bunch, of, I have 10 really cool fans that I'm going to be making videos of tonight. Don't know if I'm going to get through all of them. Some of them are cooler than others, um, but we have three Mistrals, and this is the first one that I'm filming. Um, I numbered the blades, so this is the original set of blades that was on this fan. This one is by far in the best condition. The canopies are completely white. They're not yellowed even one bit, which is the first time I've ever seen that. Um, the blades are clean, the motor's clean, and it all functions perfectly. Um, Unfortunately, all of the light kits are missing glass. Uh, none of the light kits have shades. So, um, but that's whatever. I might even end up taking the light kits off these fans. I'm not too sure yet. But that's what it looks like without the light on. I put a nice age appropriate or age or period correct incandescent light bulb in it for you for the video. Um, but let's go ahead and get it started on speed low. Oh, that's the wrong fan. Okay, <laughs> let's get it started on speed low. I gave it a quick pulse of high for a second there just to get it going. And you may see that other fan that I accidentally turned on. Some of you will know what that is. But that, that came with the haul as well. That's one of the other 10 fans and that's going to be in one of the videos at some point. It's a very special fan to me and I'm really happy to have it. Got a lot of cool fans on this Perth trip. And if any of you guys know these Mistrals, you know that they are very, very high quality. The motor is uh, cast aluminium and it's completely sealed. There's no holes in it. And cast aluminium is best at um, dissipating heat. So these fans barely overheat. They use high quality bearings, which meant for, well, long, long life, smooth operation. And um, the blades are mild steel, which isn't the best, but they're very um, high quality um, and they're very heavy. Um, but these fans have no problem getting up to speed, as I'm sure some of you have seen. And they have a nice long spin down. This one's got a bit of a sway to it. The canopy is actually shifting down a bit. It shouldn't drop, um, but there's every chance that it will, honestly. Put it onto medium now. It's just on a three-speed controller because I don't have the original controller. I think I only have... Oh, actually, no, three of the... Four of the fans have got the original controller, but... Um, Three of them are all the same, and they're just three-speed controllers. I've only got I only got one proper five-speed controller with one of the fans that you'll see later. So this is just on a three-speed capacitor-based control, which are healthier for the fan motors, anyway. So that's medium. We'll bump it up to full speed, and you guys know these mistrals really kick up a breeze. as you can hear and see by how fast it's spinning. You can hear a sign that I have hanging on the wall is rattling in the wind. Okay, I'll let it spin down. I just turned it off. And like I said, you guys know these things have a long spin down. Oops.
can hear all the birds outside. Don't mind that. Assuming the birds are going to be quiet in a bit, um, I will uh, give you a zero to high because I know a lot of people like the uh, start up noise that these motors make, these Mistral fan motors. By the way, all of these fans I'm going to be for. for um, Going to be testing them as is. Also, these mistrals are only sixty watt, not sixty five. The MCFLA forty eight style three that I've had forever. Was like the first fan I ever got in my collection at 65 watts. These are 60 watts. They have a one microfarad capacitor, the other one has a 1.75 microfarad capacitor. Run capacitor, that is. Told you these things have a long spin down. This video is eight minutes long and I think half of it's spin down time. Okay, thanks for watching. And you'll see the rest of the fans um, whenever I can get to them.